is pretty wild. Winds reaching triple digit gusts and pelting rain. For Maury Bernard and his daughters, a perfect combination for coastal storm watching. The girls and I decided to come out here today to go see what the waves look like. And they weren't alone. Bundled up with hats and gloves, a few braved the blustery beach, a chance to see Mother Nature in action. Meantime, public works crews watch the destruction unfold, keeping them busy. We got all the crews on alert, and they're they're calling them when they need them. They were needed Sunday morning after power went out at a few businesses along Highway 101 in Florence. Brittany Rankin was cleaning when she saw a utility pole catch fire and blow up. It just exploded, and everything went out. The explosion sent computers off, rooms dark, and employees into manual mode. With a handful of outages reported all over the county, crews say they're working hard trying to restore power as fast as they can. Just be real patient. Uh, we're getting to it as soon as possible, and uh, you know, it, hopefully, it won't get too much worse. Power is only part of the problem. Trees are another. The limbs is what's terrible. They break off the trees, and you don't want to you don't want to get hit by them. Police say the calls have been endless, including one for this tree that fell across the road on the way to Hasita Beach. And with more wind and rain expected, everyone seems to be watching and waiting. We've got a big tree in the backyard I'm keeping an eye on. For what Mother Nature has up her sleeve next. In Florence, I'm Megan Higgins.